All right, welcome back. All right, all right, all right. Well, a five knuckle shuffle. shuffle. The most devastating signature Dude, move. He had, in all his of eyes Super. were open the whole time, <laughs> and it's just like the guy's face is terrified. <laughs> If you keep your eyes open when you're fighting, you have two options. Cover your face so they can't see your eyes open, or roll your eyes semi in the back of your head to give the illusion that you're so dazed you don't know what is up. <laughs> what I love about this is you get the whole meter from just doing knee attacks. He is the knee killer! <laughs> it's weird that I'm not player one, by the way. Yeah. In, like, most of these matches. I've been thinking that. Like I, I never, I hadn't realized it. Oh, it's a because while. you're the challenger now. I think. Oh yeah, that would make sense. I can see that. <laughs> I bet he wasn't expecting me to do that. He definitely wasn't expecting that. Now to do the most unexpected John Cena thing of all time, cheating. <laughs> this is still his move. Yeah, <laughs> I'm like looking at him do all these flips, and I'm like, he's. This is still just his move. <laughs> Yeah, like, I'm not I'm actually that. playing, yeah. How <laughs> dare you. Did he just counter your fine finisher? Yeah, let's see him counter this shit. Half for finisher. <laughs> let's see him counter this shit. Yeah, they can do that. They can also reverse your finisher, which is way worse. Because I think it takes your finisher away. And they hit their finisher. The crab! Or, uh, the crab! Out. I guess get the... Thing? I want to climb this. There we go. The most non-John Cena thing in the world! The top rope! <laughs> yeah, I don't think I've ever seen him go off the top rope. He, he, at one point in time, he used to do this leg drop. Oh, he used to do a top rope leg drop. Actually, it was a, technically it was a middle rope leg drop. You just, when you whack him with that? Like, technically that's, that's what it was. It was a middle rope middle rope leg drop because he couldn't fucking <laughs> he couldn't really at top rope attack people. Dude, I don't like understand why you would not use that. It's for being honorable, Derek. I am an honorable fighter who cheats. You're a clean fighter now. Oh wait, I'm the good guy? Interesting. <laughs> he was just pretending to be dead. <laughs> why are you a clean fighter now? Because you're the challenger, and this guy's been a pain in the ass? Yeah, I think it's because they're fucking me now. Because they've been oh, fucking yeah. me now. That, that has to be it. Alright, hold on. I have to, like, go over here, put it down like this, press... Nope. Oh, God damn it. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna figure this out. Is it square towards it? It is. That's fine, I'm okay taking this fall because now I understand how this fucking works. I'm just gonna hide here. <laughs> I mean, that works for me, I guess. <laughs> Viva la rosa! We'll just, uh, mosey on up over here. How do I grab it? Okay, that's how I grab it. And then I just wait and hope he can't stop me in time. He stopped me in time. Oh, wow, that does a lot, lot of damage. damage. Wow, that does a lot of damage. Nice choice, Eddie. He's also dead now. Eddie? Yeah. Died of a heart attack. <laughs> he keeps doing this. And he keeps missing. <laughs> I think it's because the AI is like, this would be cool if it hits. Without contemplating the fact that his whatever top rope move he's using is not a move that hits people that are on the ground, it only hits people that are standing. I think we all know what he needs, and that's a good old punch to the face! <laughs> and then some attacks to his knees. And then an immediate knuckle shuffle! <laughs> in the fucking thing! Never trust, never trust object physics in wrestling games. Never trust them. See, his head's not red yet, it's orange, so clearly I'm not attacking his head enough. That's That's been my fatal flaw. I think I agree. Time. And then you need to go for the arms, too. Yeah, that's... Because this is a no-mercy hold. Yeah, that's just, you know... Mistakes are made sometimes. <laughs> I can stop at any time. No, you need at least two... Uh, oh. Trust me. Oh, this I makes see what sense. you mean. Yeah, trust me. This is the choice. Mean. Oh, it doesn't help if he does that! 
That ain't happening. Reverse him. <laughs> that ain't Reverse him. Oh, good. That's, that's, that's now you flip him, bro. And then you grab the chair and you murder him. So I'm gonna make. A, I'm gonna bust him open. I might not need to. Okay, no, he's getting up pretty quick. There we go. Good. 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 Uh, now he's bleeding. Oh, now I'm bleeding from my face. Clunk. <laughs> oh wait, double clunk. Oh wait, a uh, triple clunk. Good. I think he's dead. DDT. No, I want to flip him over. I gotta hit him with a move that lets me flip him over. Hold on a second. I'm sorry. This is just too funny for me not to do this. I'm stealing this finisher from the Alpha Rope. Oh the five-star yes. frog splash. <laughs> yes. <laughs> which was so good and clean. <laughs> which was so good and clean. It gave me my own finisher. <laughs> So let's end this shit. <laughs> Unfortunately. Dude, he got up really fast from that frog Yeah, smash. I was thinking like, that. Like, really fast. It's way over. There's no way he's going to be able to stop get him. He shouldn't be able to. Yeah. There we go. I got both Dude, look titles! At the, look at the title thing, it's like, it's, what the fuck? That was two titles. Yeah, but the physics <laughs> of that one item was like, this is so dumb. Oh, yeah. You better have two fucking belts they're, on they're over his shoulders. <laughs> both titles. Oh my god, he does. Wow, they really ran full with this storyline. I got both WWE Championship titles. I love this game. Undisputed champ. So, Chris, a hundred percent, we're gonna play some more of these afterwards, right? Oh, absolutely. Good. They, they're great, honestly. They're great. I've never played this one. This is all new to me, so this is extra. Like, what the fuck is going on to me? <laughs> if we play through this again, is it gonna have the same story, or is it not going to be? If we choose the different it's, options, you can choose different options, and they'll give you different stories. Oh, that's cool. Like, we can fight Mr. McMahon the whole time, I... and and that storyline, Kurt Angle, never comes back, and you literally fight with him all the way till the championship. I kind of want to do that, but. Maybe we'll do that in the next game. Maybe we'll do that at some point. With the um, knee killer. The knee the next killer. game. <laughs> we'll be playing one of the other WWE games, because uh, there's what, plenty of What about the one with time travel? I remember you telling me there's one about yeah, time travel I for don't, some reason. <laughs> I don't know which one it is. It's not the time travel in the way you think. Like, they don't go back in time. It's like... They give you the ability to go back and replay matches, and they explain that with, Oh yeah, I built a time machine. You built a time machine? Yeah, of course I built a time machine. <laughs> He's like... So what you're telling me is I can go back in time to any point I want, and fight anyone I want as many times as I want, and he was like, absolutely. What do you think a time machine's good for? <laughs> oh no, we're gonna get attacked. Yep. Oh, my spine! Man, this JBL guy just won't fuck off. <laughs> hey, he was banned until the next pay-per-view. Or no, wait, was he banned until No Mercy? No Mercy, yeah. Ah, uh, okay, I guess he's back then. But we're gonna start the match with damage. Because of this. Oh yeah, absolutely. Maybe we're just not gonna wrestle tonight, because we were jumped. Yeah, maybe can Kurt, we can just skip it, right? Yeah, maybe Kurt Angle's a good guy. Oh no, Vince McMahon's Vince back. Vince McMahon's back. I got your back, pal. You're a marked man. How marked? Worth is there's a hundred thousand dollar bounty on your head. <laughs> Why, Mr. McMahon? It is absolutely inexcusable that someone would put a price on my champion's head. If he can't compete, SmackDown loses ratings and revenue. <laughs> That's all that matters to me. Investigation is underway, and I guarantee. That we're gonna figure out who put the price on your I wonder who. I, he, There's I, like 17 different people. I wonder if I have a weird feeling that it's gonna be Vince McMahon. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> In the meantime, I think it would be best for the champ to lay low for a few weeks until this settles down. I'm game. Yeah, I'm good with that. <laughs> it's just the fucking what Vince McMahon say, death stare. Uh, um, is that sounds like a great idea, Vince. Mr. McMahon. No one fucks with Mr. McMahon. <laughs> no chance. He was a good wrestler when he was get. when he was wrestling, right? Not really, but he was good enough. Good enough that yeah. he was able to He's, work his way up the the chain. He was like, uh, wait, Kurt Angle or Mr. McMahon? Mr. McMahon. 
Yeah, no, he was like, he never needed to work his way up. He was the boss uh, on day one. Um, he just like putting himself in storylines. <laughs> Just one wait a minute tonight. I might not walk out of here with a championship, but I'll sure as hell earn that hundred grand bounty. So he's gonna Why does me? the Big Show have a tattoo? Big Show doesn't have a tattoo. Champ, when you're too beaten down to defend that title anymore, I'll be first in line for it. So basically, what he said there is he's gonna murder us. Mm. Yeah. Maybe he had him removed, actually, and he used to have tattoos. I, for some reason, I don't remember him having tattoos at all. I'm, like, so confused. John Cena, what happened to me laying low for a couple weeks? Uh, I didn't see the time. I, sh I wasn't paying attention to the date. <laughs> That's, yeah, good point. There was a date thing. Can you dig it, sucker? That's Booker T. Maybe like we could have skipped and not had a issue. The Big Show just left the WWE now. He's at AEW. That. Yeah. yeah. He's also a color commentary now. I'm a color commentator now. Which is weird because that makes AEW have like nine of them at this point. Hey, they got time to, you know. They get days off now. Yeah, they get days yeah. off. They're, they don't have to announce every show. Somebody comes in with a fucking gun and shoots John Cena. See, I wonder if this game's gonna let me lift the big show. Because John Cena can lift the big show. What? Hmm. That was weirdly impactful for the first move. Oh, I bet you didn't see this coming. The final shovel. Now we're di oh. We're still clean. I don't know why we're still clean. We're, we're good guys now. We're the champ, Derek. The, oh, yeah. the champ is always the good guy. Oh, yeah, you're right. Have you never seen Hulk Hogan? <laughs> oh, yes. Because he was the good guy all the time. Yes, always the good guy. Hulk Hogan kind of was always the good guy, though. What is wow, the impact just, of that? I think it's because he's in such a high weight class that they're just like, isn't it amazing he did a throw on him or something? I have no idea. It's very weird. Yeah, but it's okay, because our signature move is starting up again. <laughs> hey, Big Show, you want to know what's the best way to handle a big guy like you? Attack the knees! Oh god, he hit you in the balls. From the knee killer, John Cena. <laughs> Don't get it! Every fucking time! The knee killer, John Cena. Can we uh, <laughs> grab a weapon? Because I feel like we no, we can not No, we can't. No, we can't. No, we can't. No, we can't. Uh, okay. Yeah, no, there's no DQ. There's uh, disqualifications in them. Not that it matters when you're the champion. If you get disqualified, you get to keep your belt. Really? <laughs> yes. Uh, trust me, many, many a villainous here, uh, uh, title holders have used that to their advantage. Same thing with countouts. If you, uh, if you lose by countout, you also don't lose your belt. That's really like. Yeah. So there's a lot of time like villain champions would just like be like, I'm done with this match, and would just leave the ring, and like that was it. That's like. Smart, but also like holy shit. Yeah, it's clever. Right? I'm sure that after a while, the ratings are like, yeah, we need them to lose the the belt. It works when the it works when they're a villain. It does not work so well when they're a hero. Yeah. Because <laughs> like you're trying to make them as despicable as possible. I like that when I'm trying to pick him up off the ground because I'm sick of attacking him on the ground. Then he counters me <laughs> to get up. Whoa. Well, it's the big show. Oh, play that shit in slow motion for me. Every time. I was originally going to just go for the FU, but now I really want to oh, use the choke slam thing. on the big show. <laughs> yeah, I was thinking that. I was just like, yeah, but you're so close to getting two, so might as well steal his thing, yeah, right? Yeah, right, honestly. Whoa. Whoa. Got him. Got him. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> Every time. <laughs> Every time. Let's try this again. Let's do this. I'm going for the jerk slam. Fuck it. I'll handle talking about what it feels like to be in the ring. It's gonna be too tall. <laughs> 
game is great. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Whatever you say, game. The disrespect. <laughs> oh, you fucking choke slam, though. I love it because the Big Show is big enough to actually do that to people, but oh, John yeah. Cena could not do that to them. <laughs> I like how long he held him. Just like, you know, you could easily hold this man in one arm for an hour. Uh. <laughs> this 500 pound monster of a man. Oh. Wait. Oh, oh shit. Booker T. Oh, can you dig it, sucker? <laughs> he showed up. He has a talk show now. It's pretty good. I would recommend it. <laughs> this is my bounty. Oh, Michael Cole, you're just so lame. <laughs> I'm out here. Yeah, John Cena's just like, time to escape to There's the back. Man, I was thinking about trying to claim that bounty myself. He's definitely going to be a lot safer on Raw. Wait, am I going to Raw? I don't know. Oh, I think that's what's happening, actually. I think they're putting me on Raw to escape the bounty on my head and SmackDown. <laughs> Which does make me feel like this was Mr. McMahon's plan all along at that yeah, point. Yeah, we're in Raw now. Yeah, we're on Raw. I was not expecting this. This is amazing. And I love it. There is... The twist and the turns. They were owned by the same company, right? Yes. Okay, They're so they could do... The they, can, they can do stuff like this. Oh, yeah. All the time. They, they used to do it, like, constantly for a while. There, there was a point in time where if you were, like, a, the grand champion, you just had to fight on, like, every goddamn brand whenever they wanted. Oh, yeah. Oh, but we have to figure out who the champion of this is, because oh, we know we're the true. champion of the other one, and they can't get the belt back now that we've left. I think we're the champion of this brand now, because they probably swapped champions, if I had to guess. Tends to be how that goes. Tonight, ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to introduce the newest member of the Raw roster... SmackDown's own WWE Champion. <laughs> wow! I thought we had two belts. Why is he not wearing them both? Because they combine them. Uh, I think you'll find into one bigger one. <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> and we're a little tougher than we're used to. Oh shit! For talking instance, shit about my brand. My brand. brand. General manager didn't have the guts to say. If anyone on this show tries to claim any kind of bounty tonight, they'll be fined one hundred fifty thousand dollars and suspended for a month. That's a pretty so good deal. Ready, champ, because tonight's main event is a non-title match between you and Christian. Christian, does he have a long hair in this game, or does he have short hair? By this point, I'm kind of curious. Christian Cage. He used to be the brother of Edge. This guy. He has short hair. He used to be the brother of Edge, and then they walked that shit back, and they were just real close friends for a long time. <laughs> Why'd they walk it back? Because they weren't actually brothers. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> but they did it. Enough but, they, brothers. but they did it because their tag team was rivaling with the Hardy Brothers, who were real brothers, and the Dudley Boys, who are also real brothers. Ah, <laughs> uh, Christian and Edge. You know... Close enough to be brothers. <laughs> Close enough to be brothers. I mean, they were friends since, like, they were, you know, like, five. Close enough <laughs> to be brothers. Close enough, so it worked out. What am I doing? Why am I not skipping this? How many copyright claims was that? Seven. <laughs> Hopefully oh, these don't require a lot of editing. <laughs> Hopefully. Yeah. I'm hoping, I don't think they will. I love that. Look at the rules here. And if did you see the background in the, in the yeah, camera? Yeah, they shows on the camera. Yeah, I love it. I love it. Ladies and gentlemen, good evening and welcome to another sold out. Ah, Jim Ross. Portland, also Oregon. works for AEW now. It's been far too long since Raw has come to Portland, Jr. These fans are going. Jerry crazy. the King Lar. He still Each works for Raw. Has what it takes to go all the Stare way down to battle. The oh God, what am I doing? Oh, I mean, I'm pretty sure I pressed that pretty quick. <laughs> I think he did too, but. Oh no, I was out of range and he was in range. The mistakes were made. Oh no, he's taking off the thing too. <laughs> what is with everyone I fight and their fucking obsession with removing the goddamn ring pose? Because AI. Good point. Punch, punch, punch. This is a very clean fighter move. Yes. When you just 
punch him in the face a lot. Also, shattering kneecaps is a very clean, clean fighter. Clean, clean fighting, fighting move. move. The knee killer is a clean fighter. He doesn't fight Doherty, he just goes for the knees. The clean knees. This yeah. voice is eventually going to kill me. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I agree. Never underestimate the power of a good old knee beating. Why am I picking him up? Oh, because he can't win. Fair enough. He's murdering you. Oh, I somehow got him first. I'll take it. Snap back. Oh, nice. Kick to the back of the head. Five knuckle shuffle! <laughs> you can't see it, but I also do his his motions when he does it. <laughs> yeah, Dirk's really into John Cena. My boy. He's his boy. John Cena is his new Dwayne The Rock Johnson. That and The Undertaker. I love The Undertaker. Yes. Most of the because of The Undertaker is well, as I, anime as you can go. I make the joke because they both went on to be Hollywood stars. Yes. <laughs> and that's why I knew them. Come on, John. God damn it. I was almost up. <laughs> oh, you thought you were going to grab me, but here I am yeah. grabbing you. Hitting you with my knee. Snaps you blacks. <laughs> yeah, I bet you weren't expecting that kind of a, a suplex. <laughs> That's what I thought. Should I always go for their finishers just solely so I, I can show so. off? I think so. There are all these characters finishing moves. I think so. Wow, well, this DDT is just a big deal. Like, <laughs> it's just a big deal. I was just going to say. Boom, five knuckle shuffle. Soon, Chris, I'll be knowing wrestling terms. <laughs> Boom, five knuckle shuffle. This one right here, the knee killer. <laughs> <laughs> that is what it's called in my book. It doesn't really have a name. The knee killer. It's not really a move, it's just I'm stomping on your leg. <laughs> I know a couple wrestling ones. Like that one, that's the that's the stomach smasher. <laughs> that, that's, that's a the low groin punch. That's a low blow. <laughs> This, that's the knee killer. I'm just gonna do moves and then you tell me what they're called. That's the choke out. <laughs> but we're not on the neck, we're on the head. Hold on, Through I, the head. Actually, hold on, I got I got what I need to do is move now. I want, I'm curious if he has the kill switch at this point. He should, that's like his main go-to. What? Oh, fuck you, man. <laughs> screwed me. And you'll just have to work your way up again oh, well. to the next one. I was kind of hoping they gave me it, but, yep. Whatever. I'm just, now I'm just gonna finish him off. We're almost out of time. This is better this way. <laughs> I think when you do theirs, do you do extra damage and everything? I think so. And I think you also get enough meter to do, do it again. again. Well, not every time. Because there was that one time I did it, and he kicked out. Two. Um, he has this move called the kill switch where he like spins them around and puts them face first and then literally just falls onto their face. <laughs> That's amazing. Like full body weight onto their fucking head That's and amazing. face. Dude, you, when you, well, that video and whenever we say it, anime is so, re like, wrestling is so anime. It is very anime. Dude, are we gonna have somebody try to claim the bounty? <laughs> well, they can't. They'll be suspended for a month and be fined more than what the bounty is worth. Yeah. So it's not worth it. Uh, now point. he wants the bounty though. Now he's upset. <laughs> now I'm sad. I was beat by someone on SmackDown. That's the lesser of the brands. <laughs> That's actually how wrestlers felt, actually. Still kind of to this day. That's actually interesting. Yeah. They were not seen as good if you're on the uh, SmackDown on show. SmackDown? Yeah. Even though it's the better show and more consistently puts on better fucking matches. Better it doesn't get more views, so. Interesting. That's weird. Less, uh, That's less weird. playful. That's weird. Yep. It's probably evened out more since then, because they've spent a lot of time building up that brand at this point. But back in, like, the 90s when they first made it, yeah, that was, like, the fuck you brand that you didn't want to be on. Anyways, we'll pick it up in the next part with you guys then. Peace.